Hey what's up guys this is Joy and welcome to another brand new fixing video and today in this video we're going to fix this mosquito bat. The problem with this mosquito bat is that it's charging. You see this red LED is lighted, light up and I think all of you guys know that this kind of mosquito bat creates near about 3000 to 4, uh, I think 3000 voltage. Uh, this one is working. As you see guys this one is working. The light is on and okay that's that's the electric spark we are looking for but this one do not have any spark so guys today we try to fix it okay and here we have couple of screws one two three four five screws so we'll open all of these screws one by one Now as you see guys, we open the mosquito bed and inside this we have, uh, this is the power plug, it's going to the main board, this is the main board and this on is a battery, it's around 4.2 volt, so it's a, I think it's a lead acid battery, so this is the main 220 volt, it's coming here and then this one, this is a LED and this two is going to the battery, battery positive and this one is the battery negative. And before doing anything, we're going to discharge this both two capacitors. They are near about, this one is 400 volt and this is near about 3-4000 volt. So we don't need any rigs, we will just short it. Uh, don't touch anything guys, be careful. Okay. Now this two are shorted. So there is no power on this capacitor. Now guys, I'm going to explain you what is inside this board and how it works so now guys as you see we are getting 220 volt input here here is 220 volt if you are living in usa it probably 110 main to this board is connected by this resistance let's find out this resistance is okay or not it's around 671 kilo ohm as you know guys v equal to volt uh, volt equal to i r we will if we increase the R it will drop the I so the basic arcs of a resistance is reducing the current flow so this resistance okay and it's connected here with a diode so let's check the diode so for checking the diode you need to put your multimeter on this buzzer mode okay this is a buzzer mode and one side it will show a value and one side it will show one some value Okay, this diode is okay, this diode is okay, this diode is okay. So as you see guys, the main power supply circuit is okay, so we don't need to check it. And I think this capacitor is also okay. So the main problem of this board is on this side because it is not creating high voltage. We are getting voltage from the battery, the problem will be on this side. So here you have a transistor and its number is double eight two so this transistor to find the problem we need to thoroughly inspect the board and try to find out is there any problem with any component but as you see guys we don't have any problem any visual sign that shows like this uh, this component is damaged so majority of time if you guys have problem getting power on this thing you have either this transform this transformer is damaged or this transistor is not working this is the transistor three pin here and we need to set the multimeter to a buzzer mode this mode and if you guys want to know more about this kind of transistor you just type the model number uh, on google and it will show you the uh, specification about this transistor so it's a npn transistor so guys to test this npn transistor we need to set this multimeter to buzzer mode. I have this NPN transistor, same model number. And here, on the positive, NP, P4 positive, we will attach with this negative lead. And on this side, on side, it will show some value. Another side, it will show no value. Now, check it on this board. It's showing some value. And this side 
is also showing some value so i think this transistor is the main culprit so guys this transistor is dead we need to replace it now let's find out like this uh, transformer is okay or not so you can check it this is the primary side primary coil i think this is primary coil i'm not sure guys so let's check it. is there any continuity we just want to we just want to check the continuity yes 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 i think this uh, transformer is okay and sometimes this capacitor also not able to hold charge but first we will replace this transistor and find out like is this board is working and if you guys want to go through this kind of hard rail to find out what is the problem on this board you can buy a replacement board it's less than a dollar i don't know where you can buy it online but uh, it's a local store i buy it only 60 indian rupees which is less than a dollar so you can buy it from there and just replace the board and you have a working mosquito pad and that's probably save you three four dollar extra so guys we are now going to desolder this uh, transistor from the board before doing anything we're just going to remove the battery battery negative and this is battery positive removed so if you guys have problem you can remove replace your battery like this way and buy a new battery and attach it here soldering paste guys this soldering guys i have a horrible soldering skills and it's really hard for me to remove this transistor from the board but i removed it now i'll replace it with another one and this is the working transistor let's replace it with this transistor put it inside the holes let's put and do some soldering what do you guys think about this it is easy or hard my solder is kind of dead guys it's broken so any company interested sending me a solder ring iron will be promoted on this channel uh, guys i'm just kidding mm -hmm. so everything is done yes now let's attach the battery this is ne this is negative negative and is positive red is positive and here is the negative negative and here is the positive now guys this is the time to test is it working this switch on press the button and ow it's working and guys if i find any kind of online purchase link of this circuit or any kind of component on this board i will leave all of this link in the description below so guys check the description for more information so guys thanks for watching the video hope you guys successfully repair your mosquito bed and if you guys have any question in session let me know in the comment section below i definitely reply every one of your question so that's being said my name is obhijitra i'm signing out meet with you on my next video till then bye bye Oh, my God.